Reporting for Business Wise, I'm Bob Pritchard. Asian stocks gained as investors anticipated further stimulus measures from Europe and China, while U.S. economic data reinforced recovery hopes in the world's largest economy. Japan's Nikkei 225, the regional heavyweight index, showed a 0.2% gain to win Tokyo's morning trading session at 14,456 even. Hong Kong's Hang Seng gained 1.1% to 21,964 .23, and South Korea's Kopsi rose 1% 1 to 1,961.04. Australia's S&P ASX 200 added 1% to 5,387.20. Stocks in Southeast Asia also advanced. China's Shanghai Composite was flat at 2,067.48. Investors welcome Europe's Central Bank President Mario Dre's speech on Tuesday in Paris that monetary policy should be supporting the economies of countries that use the euro. More investors are banking that China's leaders will introduce pro-growth measures to prop up a slowing economy. A preliminary reading of China's manufacturing, released on Monday, showed activity at an eight-month low in March. Reports showing strength in the U.S. economy also underpinned investor sentiment. The Confidence Board in the U.S. said its measure of consumer confidence rose last month to its highest level since January of 2008. Another release showed U.S. home prices edged down in January for a third month, but at a high level compared with a year earlier. In Toronto, the S&P TSX Composite Index rose almost 1.5%, up 20.94 points to 14,299.49. On Wall Street, the S&P 500 rose 0.4% to 1,865.62. The Dow Jones Industrial Average gained 0.6% to 16,367.88, while the Nasdaq Composite edged up 0.2% of a percent to 4,234.27. In energy markets, benchmark U.S. oil for May delivery was up 17 cents at 99.36 U.S. per barrel and overnight electronic trading on the New York Mercantile Exchange. The contract fell 41 cents to settle at 99.19 yesterday. Turning to currency trading, the euro fell to $1.3815 U.S. from $1.3823 late Tuesday. The dollar gained to 102.3 yen from 102.26 yen. Reporting for Business Wise, I'm Bob Pritchard.